guys, this is Rock and Roll Collectors and Killer Killer Collectibles for you, where, whichever you prefer. Today we're going to be doing a Rustic, I think I'm going to start calling this series kind of a Rustic review. Because these are figures that I'm not, I didn't get when I was serious about collecting. Um, and I don't really have all the accessories or anything to them, so. Anyway. I think I, I've done a review of this one way when my channel was just starting, and um, it was pretty bad, um, but I did have all the accessories, so I guess that's a perk. Um, if you do want to see all the accessories, check out another review, maybe a higher quality review than this one, or that video, if you really want to stay that true to my channel, but... Um, First, let's get into accessories that I do have. Okay, we're back, and these are accessories that I do have, and I don't have very many. Well, there's more that aren't on the screen, so. First accessory is this knife. He comes with two knives. Uh, one that's more of a serrated one that's actually bigger than this one, and this one's more of a combat knife. They're both combat knives, but you can see the difference. Um, pretty nice paint. Um... This one doesn't really capture an edge. I mean, I can tell they tried, but it looks very blunt to me, the edge to the knife. It looks better on camera than it actually is. Yeah, that's definitely not how it looks in real life. Um, so, yeah. Uh, the next two accessories, I know I'm kind of having a pattern of doing them in pairs. Classic katanas. I don't even know if these are actually katanas, like... They look pretty different. Um, anyway, they have the same issue with their edge. Um, you know, this one got a little bent from... I don't know. Uh, it was a quality issue. Um, let's show you the good one. Um, it does have decent paint. Again, doesn't have uh, very good edge painting. The wrap looks pretty good. Um, the sculpt is very good, as always. Um, next accessory. Sorry. Like, gosh. This camera is getting a little annoying. I can't, I gotta be honest with you. Um, I'm not a very big fan of, um, this gun kind of cartoonish and doesn't really look like a gun, but it has some good paint on it, I'll give it that. Um, so yeah, just a basic gun. Um, next accessory, um, it doesn't really count as a figure, so I'm going to count as an accessory, head pool, so this is the comic, where well, there's a few versions. Um, this is more of a classic version, which is why I said comic version, but you only really see Headpool in the comics. Um, I don't know if there's any other places where you see Headpool, but the skull painting looks very nice. Um, not a very big fan of that, but, you know, if you put it on a stand, I mean, just I'm not saying the hole, but it, where it goes onto the hole just looks crappy to me, but this, um, now, this is a very good stand, and the reason being is, for one, it's a good, like, stand, literally, um, and, can't really see, but it has a bunch of edges on it, and that helps to make light reflect something about reflection, I don't know, but, anyway, it just makes it look more clear if you have a white background, but, Obviously, I don't have a white background like most serious, more serious collectors do. While we're on the topic of accessories, though, these do not come out, which bugs me so much. Why? Marvel Legends just... Marvel Legends? I'm just kidding, but still. That's just really annoying. Like, <sighs> I was literally tempted to try and get them out, but... Just, they're, like, freaking baiting us. That's, like, freaking... They're, like, purposely trying to taunt us. Like, come on. Anyway, this, um, it came with a plethora of hands, um, but I have the, uh, thumbs up hand and, you know, the grasping hand, so. 
Um, not much to say about the detail. Yeah. Um, I really think, like, the only thing worth mentioning is the face, which is a very good attention to detail. They actually give that, you that classic Deadpool expression. Um, see the ears, and then it has that little... Right there, which you only really see in the comics once again. Um, so yeah, that was my rustic review series number two. Uh, Deadpool. Marvel Legends Deadpool. Anyway, make sure to like and subscribe. Out.